Hey there, everyone. This is Rao Cal playing Mario the Smart Pity for the bowling alley. Starting off a new level here. Testing track five. It's not a new stage though, but it's a new level. And it's an underwater place with a guy. And a spiky guy. And an angry guy. And an electric guy. And a swimming guy. And another swimming guy. And a motor guy. And another spiky guy. And no yellow guys because we don't want them around. Hey there, Electrode. How's it hanging on this bright Saturday? When I say bright, I mean that outside it's oppressively foggy. Oh. Eat a big old can of ham. And maybe we're gonna rig a camera to film you in a compromising situation. Just because I can. Go over me, thank you. Okay, okay, I'm swimming here around and the, that guy can breathe underwater somehow. Somehow, somehow, somehow. Oh, uh, yeah, that's not gonna work out for me now, is it? Oh boy. Um. Alrighty, Dighty. I'm kind of afraid of everything around me here, so I'm just gonna hurry up on in this direction and try to avoid all the oppressive nature of my adversary because I mean always try to keep an honest man down because that is what the anti-consumer report always tries to do and I kind of forgot safe state there which is something I don't do very often so so I blame Lis Listerine in its entirety okay I press the button then I clear the path now we're at a great old party you see the party is starting there with guys floating about and, and the absolute absence of sky oh man it's it's right there it's right there and you can just kind of skip everything by that fish is fast uh, let me pass please guys oh that fish is one one fast fish and there's a lot of a uh, lot of a uh, lot of medusas here they're like medusa heads only more square and tentacular Man, tentacular, I sure hope it's a real adjective, because I would use it every day. Oh man, there's a wakey guy up there. Don't wake the fishes. They're gonna be angry at me for some reason. Why can't I crash that part? It's like the easiest part in Mexico. There we go. It says E. It's exactly as I said. Where are the awakened fish, though? I don't know. Maybe they don't exist. It's all a Twilight Zone-esque plot twist device. Or they're behind me, one or the other. Okay, so where am I now? I'm not too sure, but there's probably a freaking hell god. Um, okay. Well, oh. Ah! Maybe it's, I have enough time to go wherever I need to go? That would be nice. Hey there, guy, how's it going? <laughs> oh man, I probably don't have enough time. That's just awesome. That's just awesome. <laughs> Just gonna swim under everything. <laughs> I'm under. What the hell how am I supposed to go there? Well, that's where I need to go, but where am I supposed to press that that switch thing? Can I can I deposit it on a jellyfish? Maybe. How am I going to go anywhere though? Where am I? Okay. Whoa. Okay. Oh, cool. You can deposit on a jellyfish. Um, awesome! <laughs> I have vanquished you, wall of electric death! No outlet shall stop my fork of justice! Uh, a falling, a falling piano in a staircase perhaps, but not electric jellyfishes. So I guess I need to do this here like this, take the long road around the fashion police, and kind of look in a befuddled way into the restless eyes of the future. And it's very foggy over there, so you need to have good eyes. But, yeah, a Torpedo Ted is not a functional eyesight improvement. Believe you me, it, it doesn't work. I mean, you can try it at home yourself. Try to jam a torpedo directly in your eye sockets, and uh, yeah, your eyesight won't improve. <laughs> They, they, they didn't want to show it on Mythbusters because they couldn't replicate it, but seriously, don't, don't be foolish. It's 
spaghetti is spaghetti, it's not meatballs. You need both if you want both. I don't think I have to draw a picture to explain that. Oh man, freaking hell. And I bet I'm gonna need to bring a silver P here. Because that's just the kind of thing that this level looks like it would ask me to do. Would say, hey there guy, can you bring me a, a silver P? Uh, I'm gonna get it back to you, man. I swear, you, you can trust me. But you know you can't trust him. He's as trustworthy as an angry dog. And angry dogs are not trustworthy. I mean, even if they smile, it doesn't mean they're trustworthy. You cannot trust someone merely for smiling. That, that's folly. What, what are you? What are you? Okay, so let's let's kind of take the lower route again. La 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 la, hey there guy. La 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 la, hey there guy. La, oh, that, it didn't work there. It didn't work there either. We need to take a break from the fast lane. Okay, that's that that hopefully will be. Yeah, that 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 wasn't a good thing. Ah, oh come on, don't tell me I'm stuck. No, I'm not. Yay! Yay! And everything is raining! Everything is raining! Oh man, now we're outside! Where there are fishes jumping about in the fashion of jumping fishes! I'm like, holy cow, I need to climb up this vine! And, and wait there, and then I go, hey there guys, how's it going? And then I mess up, and I start over, even though my commentary right now is getting, like, li li like, not in time, because my IDs don't go as fast as my actions, and I'm like, holy cow, that's not good. So I'm kind of def deftly not good invading his hammers, and not invading, evading. And whoa there guy, watch out, you're gonna hurt someone, and there's a dolphin. Dolphins are the world's panic race. I'm uh, not too sure how that works. Hey there, guy. Oh man, freaking Koopa Bounce! No! Koopa Bounce is the bane of my treasury. Um, not too sure how that works, but it does. I am heaven bound to destroy all traces of impurity within this realm, even if it means crashing all of Earth 2's birthday parties. Oh, I need it. Oh, okay, if I just press 4 instead of being kind of timidly pressing forward, I totally would have made it. Totally would. You see, like this. Then I can go like, hey there guy, totally made it like this. And be like, cool man. Then the... Whoa! <laughs> it's... Oh man, freaking... No... Arg. I'm not too sure what's the point of that, but... Okay! Python to the hills. There's a rope door. Rope door! Where is Roy? Hey there, Roy. Do you have pidgets in your room? It's totally not a prank call. And your walls are kind of closing in. That's totally not a prank call either. Birdman! Bird, the Birdman. He's a guy with wings and I just got a face full of Roy. Just got a face full of Roy. Oh, freaking. Oh, cr oh, cr come. Oh, wow, that was lucky. Oh man, and this is totally not the swimsuit edition of boss fights. This might be though. It, yeah, it changes mid-boss fight apparently. My logic is unscrupable. I got a bird going right over my head. Got a taste of my belly button. That's that's on my forehead apparently. Don't don't say that too loud to other people because it's supposed to be a secret. Man, well I guess. Uh, sorry about that. Whoops, uh, where's the, what's the button I press? There we go. So I guess that's it for tonight, Sumer and Pidity, for the bowling alley, Rao Cow playing, and stuff. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it for tonight. Uh, join me next time, probably tomorrow, for some more. And, uh, yeah, uh, to address something... I know I'm gonna finish this game for sure, before I start my summer I should on 2thread. I'm, I'm abandoning officially Mario Plus, because it sucks. For the rest, I'm still not sure. Alright, let's leave it to that for now.